Cindy, who needs help dealing with a teenager. Hi, Cindy. Hi, Steve. Hi. I have a 15-year-old son, and he used yeah, to be my angel. 15. Oh, f <laughs> he's 15. <laughs> I thought you said 50. I was going. <laughs> All right, 15, 15 yes, ma'am. 15, and yes. he used to be my angel, and now he just thinks I'm annoying and I can't relate to him. How do I get my angel back? Well, I, I don't know if that's possible. You know, when boys get at that age, my, I have a son that's 16, they're starting to smell themselves at this age. <laughs> no, really, they're starting to get that aroma of manhood. They think they know everything. They don't yet, but they think they do, and the person that they aspire to be is usually not their mother. I mean, your boy, he's, you know, we're not gonna be angels. You're not gonna get an angel, son. He's gonna, he's gonna adore you, he's gonna respect you, and, and put you on a pedestal the rest of his life, but you're gonna have some moments where you clash. But I like to be in control. <laughs> uh... <laughs> he's my baby! He's my baby. You should have got a dog, lady. <laughs> Just, really... <laughs> you know, these are people here. This I want not... one. Wow. This is a different group in here today, man. <laughs> <laughs> These women in here, man, whoa.